So here is my one week of weathering waves. I'm not gonna say it was sunshine and rainbows as you know, most of us that have been a day one player, if you were there, that it was very, very bad. And to put it straightforward and simple is that the game was not ready for launch. I will say that for a fact. Even though Kuro Games was pushing the game really, really hard to get all the fixes out and updating the game every single day and you know, with players just either quitting the game day one because of that or you know trying to stick out through it but still having issues and whatnot you know they were generous enough to give us a bunch of awards in terms of all those bad things that were happening on day one in terms of all the issues now basically you can get up to like a bunch of free standard pulls like limited pulls as well and a free five star selector on top of that of already the two five stars you can get for free in the game from your discounted banner and then once that banner goes away you get your another banner that gives you a five star selector up to the 80 pool mark and then you have another five star for free on top of that from just from the mailbox from the compensation rewards pretty insane Kuro games i appreciate that a lot because you guys listen on like on another certain game that does not want to listen which <clears throat> genshin sorry genshin can never so for me i've been having a fun time uh, playing on multiplayer with my friends and the co-op stuff, uh, exploring like my world and having to farm echoes on my world or on their world and doing their stuff and progressing through it. It's pretty, pretty fun. The boss fights, um, some of them can be a little tricky and gimmicky, quirky, weird, and, but once you understand the mechanics of the game in terms of the combat system, the parry, the dodging, uh, the timing of the attacks the bosses do, you will get it down pretty pretty quickly for sure but um at first it might seem like a lot but over time you'll you'll get it it'll become natural this game is really fun though for me uh the story for me overall was pretty mid if by any chance you see that skip button at the top left of the screen click it immediately because the story is mid like they need to fix and work on that for sure because you know it's not gonna be like pentacle the hsr level type of peakness but for sure, it's just it bad. So I'm only playing the game for its combat and its animations and, you know, for the experience of the game as it is, not for the story. Hell to the no, not for the story. Right now, I'm just waiting for Yinlin to drop. Uh, once she drops, I'll make a video of me doing summons for sure. And then in terms of HSR right now, by the time this actually goes out, Boot Hill and Fushuan will be out. I will be getting my E1 Fushuan. But if I lose it for some reason, which I feel like I'm going to, then I'm going to be saving that guaranteed for Firefly. So then I don't have to worry about pulling her and losing it and then having to go to hard pity for all that and whatnot because I really want to get the E2 for her and call it a day and get her SIG LC as well. And then potentially also get Jade in her LC. So just praying and hoping that it goes well for me in 2.3 because 2.2 right now has just been kind of dry. So we shall see how that goes. Um, but in terms of that, just let me know how you guys' this overall experience with the weathering waves has been since this one week has passed. Uh, drop it down in the comments below. I would love to read and reply to it. And anyway, uh, with that being said, I thought I was gonna make content on this game as much as I thought I wanted to, but I will not be doing that because I feel like it's just too early and I'd rather just stick with HSR as a whole. So with that being said, just look out for, you know, like a summons video for weathering waves or maybe like a funny moment of me and my friends doing something goofy or whatnot i don't know whatever it is it will not be as much as i wanted to but it is what it is but uh i will be sticking with hsr that's all i know for sure if you guys did enjoy the video then give me a like i appreciate it as always the sub button is also free so stay tuned for more hsr content for sure in the future don't want to miss out on that and then also join discord it's up on screen and down in the description below discord.gg slash express train we have a bunch of channels especially for hsr and a wuwa channel so if you want to drop you know discussion talks maybe some leak stuff if you want as well i uh, combine the discord and just have a good time discussing there in those channels and i would love to see you guys there and yeah, as always love anime stay motivated and live life i'll catch you guys in the next video till then peace